Y'all ready? Let's go, let's go. Hey, my connectors, welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe, join the family. If you like good food, it's the place to be. Come and have a little fun with your girl, KC. What's up, my connectors, and welcome back to the channel. So today we have a challenge, a challenge. So as you can tell from the thumbnail and the title, we are doing the two times spicy scallops challenge made by Epic Empire. I think this one was created by TLE TV, so shout out to Lee and Trinice. Oh, let me get my towel. Hold on. So all I have to do is eat 10 scallops with two times spicy sauce. And I don't believe this one is timed, but I think you got to go as fast as you can. I believe. I think so. So um, if you're new to the channel, if you could please hit your subscribe button and your notification bell so you'll be notified when a new video is uploaded. Don't forget to share, like, leave me a comment. I truly appreciate it. So y'all had to go on and do a little, a little quick one. So we can start getting these challenges done. You know, we got to do 20 <sighs> before the end of the year. This one is almost empty. Maybe I should just open a new one. I just opened a new one. It just came from the um from the Amazon or whatever. So, hey, y'all. Hey. I bet y'all said, girl, we know you just woke up from a nap and tried to hear him come do a video. <laughs> okay, I did. Just wake up. I can't believe I slept that long, y'all. It is 4.40 in the evening. I can't believe it. Oh. All right, so it's sealed. This is the first time I opened it like this. Usually they have the little tab in the inside. So because this video is probably gonna go by really, really fast, I'm going to read some more of the comments that was left on the community post. But I'm not gonna do it with the uh, lie detector. I'll wait to do that with Kit. Excuse me, y'all, this stuff hot. Hey, when you open it, it'll almost choke you. Okay. So, yeah. I'm going to put the timer on, though. I'm going to just put it on five minutes. So, hopefully, I can do it before five minutes. Because they didn't um, they didn't have a thing on here. And, you, of course, y'all know they ate that fast. Let me see. Hold on. Yeah, they did it in, like, less than... Time was. Don't forget to check out everyone. Yeah, they did it in less, really less than like three minutes. So we're going to go on and win this challenge. And I don't nobody talk about it. That's really a challenge, Casey. Yes, it's a challenge. And I'm doing their challenge. Nah, I season mine. I don't know why I season them. And I'm about to put this hot stuff on here. But it just, and it was really big. You know, we this is the big ones from uh, Rose. But it, the more you cook them, the more they shrink. So, and then, you know, I like my stuff done, done. All right, let's pour this two times spicy on there. So, shout out to the entire Epic Empire gang. Shout out to y'all. Coming up with all these little challenges. I appreciate it. So, let's I'm gonna move it around in now. Make sure it's all over it. Because I don't want y'all to say I cheated on this. I'm going to need this win. Okay. Let's roll it around. Let's roll it around. Everybody get in the sauce. Why am I so, I'm already, oh, I turned the air up. Because I was cold when I was taking my nap. <laughs> All right. Ooh, they look pretty drenched, don't they? Look too drenched, as a matter of fact. But, uh, yeah, so I sauteed these on the stove. And I used a little coconut oil. <laughs> I was trying to do a little something for the thumbnail. But anyway, now I got all this red stuff on here. All right, let's go. I'm going to put the timer on the clock. I'm going to go ahead and put five minutes up there, I think. Step back your desk and kind of close. I feel a little bump coming through on you. All right, y'all ready? Go. Oh, shoot. Oh, that's hot. Mm. Can you even see it? Shoot. <coughs> that's hot. Mm. <clears throat> mm. Oh, 
Why is it so hot today? Mmm. <clears throat> mm. So. Not as easy as I thought. I cooked this one extra long because he was big. Mmm. I ain't trying to beat nobody town. I just want to finish. Mm. Mm. I think it was more than 10. <coughs> Mm. Oh. <coughs> what is easy to stop? That one, that was hot. Yeah, that was hot. Now I got a brain freeze. My mouth on fire, my, 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 my brain froze. Woo! I thought I was doing an easy one. That I was doing the easy one for the team. Okay. <clears throat> Put my phone in. Hold on, y'all. Let me mouth cool down a little bit. Oh, I said, where's my phone? You know I'm confused. Okay. Let me read a couple of the, um, things I probably never answered before. Last time I went in order, first come, that's how I did it. So last time, I just went from the first person that left a message all the way up. <clears throat> Woo, I'm going to have to go get some juice, y'all. This was a wonderful day to go to sleep. It's been kind of raining. It's been lightning. It's not lightning now. Okay. Let's calm it down a little bit. Mmm. 
Here, I thought we were gonna pop in here and do a little easy chili. Oh. Woo! <laughs> oh, y'all have a lot more questions. I had to go read them. Woo! I think I read all these right here. Oh yeah, I read all these. All right, so I'm gonna answer these questions without the lie detector test. Just so I can get to some of y'all questions, okay? And some of them I'm going to do with the lie detector. The ones I think I need to do with lie detectors, <laughs> I'll go back and I'm gonna do those. Okay, this one says, um, uh, Sean Williams says, they kick it on your nerves today? <clears throat> not at all, not today. <laughs> well, actually, we both just got on Kiana nerves again. She says she don't like living with us no more because whatever, whatever. She'll be all right. So, yeah, we just got on her nerves <laughs> in the kitchen. So, she gone upstairs. It was kit fault. All I was doing was cooking my scallops. He walked up behind me, so I just figured we was dancing. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. Earth Millie, Earth Millie signs. I'm sorry, my mouth's still hot. Said, have you ever visited California? Yes, I did. My friend girl invited me to California to stay at her, um, what do we call them? Timeshare? We was at Newport Beach. At the Marriott. I think it was a Marriott um, Villa or something like that. But it was really nice. If I can find a picture, I'll insert a picture for you, girl. But that's where I saw Busta Rhymes. Uh, when we went to the club, I saw Busta Rhymes. I saw... Who else was there that night? I don't know, but it was so epic. That was my first trip to California. So, I'm going to answer that one on the, uh, <laughs> on the lie detector. Javon B says, did you want more than three kids? Yes, in the beginning I wanted four. But baby, I stopped. And do you think your kids are more like you? No, all three are just like kids. All I did was carry them, child. Uh-uh, they all like kids. Um, actually, none of them are like me. Personality, habits, nothing is like me. <clears throat> um, oh, okay, can't answer that one last time. I love California, it's so pretty. I can't wait to go back. Oh, I'm gonna choke on the ice. Y'all saw that? Um, uh, have you ever checked out? Oh, I'll, let, I'll do that one. Oh, this is a good one. Jenny Thompson says, do you ever, do you enjoy eating all the delicious food? Yes. I don't know what was up with that spiciness just then, though. And she says, does it make you sick afterwards? Oh, no. No, I don't play that. I'm not going to do anything that make me sick, make me laid up in the bed, cramping, hurting, stomach hurting, nothing of that. Nothing has ever made me sick. Let me think. I eat really seafood and stuff. And if I go to fast food, I eat, you know, I might buy some stuff, but I don't ever eat it all. Like if I buy two burgers, I never can really complete two burgers. Y'all know that. But no, I've never done anything that really, like, made me sick. Gave me a headache or, you know, anything like that. Um, when I eat a lot of vegetables, well, no, because even when I ate all the cucumbers and the peppers and, you know, strawberries and all that stuff, nothing, nothing happened bad. 
um, eat crab legs all the time, nothing happens. So no, good question though. Um, oh, I answered that one from Keisha. I answered that one last time. Do you really enjoy mukbangs? Yes. And Candace Collins says, do you ever get tired of doing mukbangs? No. Um, like if I'm just having a, a just a lazy day like today, I was, I was too tired to cook anything. And, um, so, you know, I just jumped up and, you know, was like, oh, let me do this challenge. But like tired, like, oh, I don't want to ever, I don't want to do this no more. No, I'm not there. Nope. I'm not saying it won't ever happen, but I'm not there yet. I really do enjoy coming in here talking to y'all and eating good food. Just like that scampi butter and that food yesterday. Was that yesterday? With the snow crabs and the scampi butter? I don't know when it, I don't know when it was, but it was so good. Oh, I think I'm going to do that scampi butter over some lobster tails. Or maybe some king crab. Then king crab would soak it up. Because it takes on the flavor of... Okay, I'm being greedy. Okay, listen. Um, Kathy says... Oh, I'll let him answer that. I'll, answer, I'll let him answer that, Kathy. We're going to do the um, lie detector test again. I was just trying to go through some of the questions. I'm sorry. I'm sniffling, y'all. Um, Mira T says, Casey, I read some of the questions and fell out laughing. <laughs> Erica Wilson said, me too. Yeah, that, these are funny questions. Oh, this question is for Kit. Okay, Courtney. Talking about this question is for Kit. Um, eating with Shadea says, do you like fried chicken? Yes, I like. I like the chicken. I like like um Wingstop. Um, and I can eat Popeyes, but I'm gonna pull it apart, and that kind of like makes everybody mad. But it is what it is. But I can eat Wingstop, but not the flat. And I can just go to town on those for some reason. Especially if I get it well done and I know it's cooked. I'll do that. But not like a big chicken breast. No, I've got to pull that apart. I'll eat it. But I don't eat it the way everybody wants me. And here's another thing, y'all, real quick. I know this is a talking video, but. You know how people be saying, be yourself. Keep it real. And then when you eat chicken, the way you eat chicken, they say, why are you eating it like that? You told me to keep it real and be myself. <laughs> That's myself. You gonna tell me to be myself, then try to change the way I eat? I'm just playing, y'all. But it, I'm not playing. I'm serious. All right. Let me see. Oh, I think we answered that one. But I'll wait to do that one. Uh, I can answer this one. Zoe says, do you really love lobster? Yes, I really love lobster. Especially when it's well cooked, like done. Y'all know how I like it. Excuse me, let's answer a few more. It's 5 o'clock. We'll go to about five, 10 more minutes. So it says, will you go, oh, will you? I, I'll answer that one on the thing. Let's see. Oh, this is a good one. I'm going to go ahead and answer this one. This is from Summer. Summer says, do you personally think Kiana's cooking is better than your own cooking. Absolutely. Yes. I think she cooks better than me. Yeah, I think she does. Y'all hear that thunder? Uh, let's see. I can answer this one now. Katie says, do you like sardines? Um, no, I used to eat them, but no. And then she says, do you like black olives? Yes. Uh, is that Kalamata? Kalamata olives or those are different than just black olives. But I love olives. Any olives. Um, let's see. Are you scared of everything that's going on in the world? Absolutely, Samantha. Yeah. I'm scared for people. I'm scared for the future of the children. I'm scared for a lot of things. I'm scared for the economy. I'm scared for, you know, everybody and everything. You know, especially, you know, minorities. Yeah, I am definitely, I definitely am. Um, but I'm faithful. I keep the faith. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and answer this one, Stacy, without the lie to take the test. So, do I want more children? No, I don't want any more children. I think because, I mean, we've. We raised our kids. They're all almost in their 20s. And. Nah. I think it's time for me and Kitty to just, you know, have fun, enjoy ourselves. 
But, um, and I don't want to put that responsibility on anybody else. Like, oh, can you watch my baby today? Can you, the we had enough help. Our timing was perfect. Our family really, really did help us out a lot. Do you like to decorate? I love to decorate. Um, even when, even, even if it stressed me out, I like to go, cause I like what I like. Uh, I haven't decorated it like in a long time though. But yeah, when I first moved, I was going to the store. Oh my God, y'all. I was going to the store every single day. I would, I think I told y'all this. I would be in Walmart at like three o'clock in the morning, the 24 hour Walmart on university on, uh, not university on sunrise. Sunrise on <laughs> plantation, baby. I used to be at that, me and my mama and Leisha used to be at that Walmart. Leisha would sit literally on them people chair, like, you know, the little futons they would have be selling. And she will be on the phone with like one of her friends. <laughs> me and my mama be in the Walmart shopping. I love, I loved it. Just looking for pieces for your house. Looking for like, um, you know, just everything. Cause every room had a theme. Um, and that was my thing. I would go. So look for stuff for the bathroom, look for stuff for the bedrooms. And every time you see a little piece, you'll be like, oh, that's perfect. That'll go there. Oh, that's perfect. But yeah, that was, that was so much fun. So hopefully I'll be able to do that again one day. Or maybe just redecorate this house. I don't know. But, um, uh, do you like to cook? Girl, no. I cook these scallops. Shot. You'd have thought I was cooking a whole gourmet meal. It wasn't but 10 scallops or more. Uh... Would you go on vacation? With, oh, that must be for Kit. Oh, was that for Kit? Oh, that was, I'll let him answer that, Stacy. I thought that was for me, but I was for Kit. All right, I answered that one. Uh, let's see. Uh, I'll answer that on the thing. I'm gonna go ahead and answer this with Mika. Mika talking about, do I get on your nerves with my welcome comments? Uh, no. Girl, no. Uh-uh. Um, this one is from Joan Tipton says, do you support different races dating one another? Uh, yeah, love is love. Date who you want, child. Mm-hmm. Date who you want. As long as you're being, um, treated right, you're happy. That person is happy. Yeah. Do your thing thing. What is this? Everybody always says they haven't been to Cali. <laughs> um, so this one is from Janetta. She says, Miss Reaper. <laughs> Better know it. You saw what I just did to that. Little old easy chalice. Yeah, it wasn't hot. I'm lying. That thing was hot. Um, what number are you out of your siblings? I'm number five. Alicia's number six. And that 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 that's how you know she's spoiled. She's number six. I'm number five. Okay. Yeah, she's spoiled. Um, have you been in Cali? Yes. What's your zodiac sign? Capricorn. Um. <laughs> T, I'm gonna go ahead and answer yours. T Brown says, deep down, do you really want to be vegan? Deep down inside, I don't know about vegan. I would say pescatarian though. I could I could be pescatarian, but the only thing, you know, every now and then I probably want some wing stock. But other than that, yeah, I could be pescatarian. I can eat seafood every single day. I try to add a little variety to the channel, but no, I, I, could, I could literally be pe um, pescatarian. <clears throat> honey, honey, honey. Um, oh, I answered this one. Jenny Day says, Casey, would you ever do a mukbang without your wig on? No. Uh, even though I know you're beautiful with or without one. Thank you. But yeah, I answered that one. So, mm-mm, share. Oh, I answered that one too. Oh, she said, do Kiana get on your nerves when she's cooking? Uh-uh, because she don't let you in the kitchen. Mom, do you need something? Because 
I be going in there trying to taste her food and stuff while she cooking it, but no, she don't get on my nerves at all. Kiana don't get on my nerves at all. You know, she just, we be bothering each other. But no, this house is fairly quiet. I'm the only loud person in here. Okay, let me answer this one right here. Because it's not really a yes or no. So, Rachel Bell says, would you rather have a dumb husband or a smart husband? Tell the truth. Uh, smart. What the world am I doing? With? <laughs> okay. But yeah, smart. I, I'm, I'm very happy that my husband is very intelligent, very smart. Um, I'm glad that he's a uh, self-taught. Like, he, you know how you want to learn something? He is very good at learning whatever he needs to learn. It doesn't matter if it pertains to his job or it's just something he wants to know. He is very, very good at um, taking the initiative to go and learn something. So I love that about him. I really do. He's not the type to say, oh, I don't know. He's one to let me, let me look into it. Let me research it like that. So yeah, yeah, yeah. SNA Nation says, I love you. I love you too. Um, let's see. Let me answer this one. Leah from Texas says, would you get another, would you get a tattoo? I want to girl, but my stomach be hurting. Every time I think about it, I get nervous. And I, and my pain tolerance is pretty high, but I don't know. I get nervous. Cause one thing I'm like, Ooh, what if it really hurt? Another thing is what if I don't like it once it's on my body? Like I can't take it off. So I don't know. Like I gotta be confident and that's really what you want. Why is this thing blurry? Oh my, one more. <laughs> uh, let me answer this one right here. It says, do you think we would get a second stimulus check? Girl, I don't know. I'm going to say yes, just for the sake of everybody that that is in need of it. Yes. Yes. Let's just go on. Yes. Just print some more stuff. Print some more stuff. Um, all right. Let's see. I dropped my towel. Olivia Tatum says, will you order snow crabs online? I, I will if I can find some really good ones, but I haven't. I've never ordered them online. Um, the only thing I've gotten in the mail is King Crab, and that was when a company sponsored the video. I forgot which company it was, but yeah, but I've never ordered the, the snow crabs online. <sighs> Thank goodness, you know, Rose has never run out or anything. You know, they've been a little shaky during the quarantine and stuff, but for the most part, they still get them in. Last question. I'm going to answer this one. Um, Sierra... Sweet Sierra TV says, do you wish you would have married a rich man? Not at all. Because a rich man can, can treat you like a dog. A rich man <laughs> can um, belittle you and make you feel this big. And a rich man can also, not saying that everyone does, but I'm just saying I would not just marry him because he's rich. Because I don't want to be treated any kind of way because you have money. I want to be with somebody who believes that I can achieve just as much as he has achieved or we can achieve it together and you respect me and I respect you. You honor me and I honor you. Um, just having a rich man does not bring me happiness. You know what I'm saying? Cause you could be rich and extremely miserable. Um, I could have married a rich man and been very depressed, um, had anxiety and walking on eggshells every time he comes in the house. I don't want that life for me or anybody else. It's not fun. Um, no, and I want to learn with him and value him and not just want him for his money. Because what if the rich man has to file bankruptcy or, you know, loses all his funds? Then it's time for me to bounce because we don't have nothing in common but the fact that he's rich. And... <clears throat> He can do whatever he wants, be with anyone, be with anyone he wants, and he'll just bring me a couple of gifts and say, Here, here's a few purses, or here's a few, you know, go get your hat on, go get your nails done, and talk to me like um, you know, this big. Uh-uh. That's not what I want. 
and rich is relative you know what i'm saying you could you could be wealthy and all that kind of stuff but then you as your a person in your character can just be foul you know so no no thank you mm -mm. i'm happy with my choice after two deck two and a half decades oh better going down i'm still happy with my choice and i would do it all over again i love him <laughs> period all right so i'm gonna go y'all Thank you so much for the questions. We will finish the, not finish, but do part two of the Q and A um, with the actual machine. I just wanted to answer some of these because this video was kind of short. So I hope you guys are enjoying your weekend. I'm probably gonna edit this video and probably go back and take my nap because I was sleeping so good. So much love, peace and blessings to each and every one of you. And until the next video, continue making connections with endless possibilities. I love y'all. Bye y'all.